ready to open the hood, use tool for the tutorials, and for car parts, the right idea is the Mr. Auto app. Easy, fast, and with better prices than on the website. For this operation, get hold of the diesel fuel filter that you will find in the video description. Turn off the ignition, pull up the handbrake, pull on the bonnet release lever and open the bonnet. Take off the engine cover. You will then be able to see the diesel filter. To be able to access the diesel filter, you must first take off the protective plate. To do this, remove the holding leads using socket wrench and an 8mm socket. Then remove the nut with an 8mm socket. Finally unscrew the lead using the same tools. Unscrew the holding stem on the engine cover. Using a flathead screwdriver, unscrew the power connected to the filter. Remove the protective plate. Now, disconnect the hoses from the diesel filter. Using a flathead screwdriver, lift the central part of the lead, then push on the edge of the lead to free the hose. Place paper towels to absorb any diesel that could leak out. Then disconnect the second hose by pushing on the white coloured part with a flathead screwdriver. Using a socket wrench and a 24mm socket, unscrew the filter flange by turning it anti-clockwise. Take a liquid collector for the diesel. You can learn how to make one by watching another of our videos, How to Make a Collector for Liquids. Place the flange in the container. Using a large flathead screwdriver, lever off the washer of the diesel filter so you can remove it. Place a container to collect the liquid underneath. You must now drain the filter. Using a syringe or a hoovering tool, remove the diesel so you can completely clean the flange with a paper towel. Please support us. Subscribe and like the video, that will be really cool. Then, remove the rubber O-ring from the cover. Clean the filled cartridge as well as the cover using a brake cleaner fluid and a piece of tissue. get the new filter. Oil the joint of the cover and put it in place on the cover. Insert the new filter element, pushing downwards to the bottom of the box. Since your vehicle is not equipped with a primer pump, it is vital to pre-fill the filter before starting your car. Take a container filter with oil and fill the filter. Place the cover back into the new cartridge. Then, screw the cover back in until it reaches the stopping spurs.
clip the diesel inlet and outlet hoses back on. Then put the protective plate of the diesel filter back in place. Reconnect the electric connector, then reassemble the different elements. Put the engine cover back on. Operation completed. Hello, if this video helps you, like and subscribe.